Assalamualaikum and hello everyone. How are you? I hope everyone is doing fine. My name is Miss Ain, and today's lesson is meant for Year Four pupils. Take out your Get Smart Plus Four book and refer to page eleven. Today we're going to do some writing activity. To be exact, we are going to learn how to write an email. Okay? Before we start, let's look at the learning standards as well as the learning objectives of the day. The learning standards are And the learning objectives are Teachers, please note that this lesson is based on lesson 14 in the SOW. So what are we waiting for? Let's go! Okay, so before we start, I would like to ask a question. Have you sent an email before? To whom? And what was it about? Do let me know in the comment section below. Well, in an email, typically you have to and from. To is where you put in your friend's or the receiver's email address. From is where you put your own email address. Let's begin our lesson by reading an email sent by Kumar. He is describing his favorite sport. Let's read them together. Pay attention as later I would ask you some questions and you need to fill in some particulars based on the email. Let's go. Hi, my name is Kumar and I'm 10 years old. I'm from Malaysia and I live in Malacca. I've got a brother. His name is Rama. Have you got any brothers or sisters? In this picture, I'm playing football. Football is my favorite sport. What's your favorite sport? Please write back soon. Bye for now. Kumar. It's very simple, right? Now, to test your understanding, let's answer a few questions. If you think you need to read again, you can always replay that part, okay? First question. How old is Kumar? Yes, Kumar is 10 years old. Max, where is he from? Yes, he's from Malaysia. Number three, where does he live? Yes, Kumar lives in Malacca. Question four, has he got any brothers or sisters? Good job! Yes, he has one brother. So the next question is, what is his brother's name? Yes, it's simple, right? Rama. Last but not least, what is his favorite sport? This is simple as well. Exactly, football. Well done everybody! Now that you have understood the content of the email, you need to fill in these particulars based on Kumar's email. You may need to pause this video and complete this form first. Later, if you want to check your answer, you can always come back to this video. Hello again! So, have you filled in the form? Let's check your answer. Name. What's your answer? Yes, Kumar. Just write Kumar. You don't have to write his name is Kumar or you don't have to write my name is Kumar. Okay? Just simply put Kumar. H. 10 or 10 years old. He's from? Malaysia. He lives in Malacca. Family. What did you write for family? Yes, one brother. He likes. 
Yes, it's a one word answer. Football. Have you got all correct? Good job. Now we have come to the essential part of the lesson. We are going to write an email. Let's do this together. Before we start, I would like to share some writing tips. Number one, begin your email with hi or hello. Number two, write about you, your family, and your hobbies. Tips number three, end your email with your name. Now, let's choose one favorite sport to talk about. Let's talk about ice skating, shall we? Well, this is the template that we are going to use. This template can serve as your reference. Just fill in the blanks with your own words. Why don't we do this together? Watch and learn. As later, you need to do it on your own using your own words and your own favorite sport. Alright, so to begin. Two, what should we write? Yes, your friend's email. So let's just say I would like to write sham at gmail.com. Alright, from. From is where you have to put in your own email address. Let's just say I would like to put missain at gmail.com. Alright, as I said, we can begin our email with hi or hello. So I will start off with hi. My name is Miss Ayn and I'm 30 years old. I'm from Malaysia and I live in Ipoh. I've got a brother or you can also write this. I've got two sisters and three brothers. I've got two brothers. Depends on your own family. Okay, next. Okay, for this part, depends on your own family. If you only have one brother, you can say his name is. Or if you have one sister, you can say her name is. But if you have more than one sibling, you can say their names are. For example, their names are Akmal, Kamal, Kamil, and Afika. Those are my siblings' names. Now, let's just continue with the next one. Have you got any brothers or sisters? In this picture, I'm playing. Or you can say, in this picture, I'm ice skating. Or, in this picture, I'm playing football. In this picture, I'm playing tennis. In this picture, I'm swimming. In this picture, I'm whatever. You can write your own favorite sport, okay? And then the next sentence is, Ice skating is my favorite sport. Football is my favorite sport. Or tennis is my favorite sport. It depends on you, actually. The next sentence or question would be, What's your favorite sport? Please write back soon. Bye for now. And what should we end our email with? Yes, our own name. So I'm just going to write Miss Ayn over there. There you go. It's simple, right? And you can paste your picture in the box below. So do you think you can do it on your own? First, you need to think of your favorite sport and choose one friend to send your email to. Please make sure that you use correct punctuation like full stop, comma, capital letters in your writing. If you have finished writing, you can send the email to your teacher. She or he will check your writing. Okay, I think we have come to the end of our lesson. That's a lot that we learned today, right? I hope you enjoy learning with me today and be more confident in writing an email to your friends. If you like learning with me, please subscribe to my channel. Call me Miss Ayn. I hope I can help you in your learning with my videos. Till then, Assalamualaikum and goodbye.